Tata Motor Limited is making a comeback into the Malaysian market via partner DRB Highcom with the launch of its commercial vehicles on Wednesday. The partnership to be signified further with DRB Highcom soon to assemble Tata's light and medium commercial vehicles at its Pekan plant. DRB Highcom Group Managing Director Tan Sri Muhammad Kamil Jamil said the collaboration would be mutually beneficial as it was in line with DRB Highcom's business model for the long term. It's, it's, it, it has always been our, our modus operandi and our business model is that we look for a long term solution. Huh? We don't look for a, you know, a importation and then the, uh, selling cars. Uh, we have to work with the uh, uh, Tata Group as well as the, as, as the Malaysian authorities to look into how do I or we optimize the uh, relationship um, to go by way of CKD and, and, and perhaps in future we can have a joint collaboration in respect of a uh, common vehicle. Speaking to reporters after the unveiling of Tata's Zenon pickup and Prima Prime Mover on Wednesday, he said 25 million ringgit would be set aside of this 10 million was for the 3S center and 15 million for the assembly line. Tata brand in Malaysia will be marketed by DRB Highcom Commercial Vehicles in Berhad, which currently is contributing 20% revenue to DRB Highcom's auto division. Overall, for 2015, he said, the group is confident to be able to ride the challenging year, looking at further minimizing the impact of the weaker ringgit to its bottom line. He, however, believed the impact would be temporary as the country's economy target is still in growth trajectory.